We'll guide you through how to download and install Optifine for Minecraft 1.21.6. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. Optifine is a great addition for Minecraft. It will go and optimize the game, but it also allows you to go and use shaders as well. So to get started with this, we need to go and close Minecraft like so. Then what you need to do is come to the bottom of your computer and open up a web browser of your choice. Then what we can do is go and search for Optifine. You can go straight to optifine.net or go and search for it. Once you're here, you need to go to the top and press downloads. You should go and see the option for Minecraft 1.21.6. We can go and see the preview versions are available, so click on it to expand it. We can go and get the most recent one. When you're watching this, there may be a full release. And what you can then do is go and press download like so. You're going to go and get taken to an offer or ad wall here. Just be aware if you see a download button, the download button is for the ad. What you need to do is go and click on the skip button in the top right like so. Here we are, and then what we can do is go and press download and it will go and download onto our computer. Now, what we can do is we can start the install process. Just before we do that, a big shout out to the sponsors of this video, Apex Hosting. They're my go-to place for a Minecraft server, so if you're interested, there'll be a link down below in the pinned comment and the description. Right now, you can go and get a discount, so it's definitely worth checking out. What you can do is you can go and scroll down and you'll go and see they offer one click install mod packs, DDoS protection, 24 seven servers and support, meaning you can get the help anytime you need it, ultra latency, instant setup, and so much more. So if you're interested, go down below and check them out. A big thanks to them for sponsoring this video. So what you can do is we can then come out of that and we want to go and open up our downloads. So I'll come straight here. You can open up your file explorer and go and find it. And here it is, Optifine. You want to go and double click on it like so, and it should open up. If you find that it doesn't, maybe nothing happens, something else happens, this is because we need Java. Come back to your web browser and you can search for Java or go straight to java.com. What you can then do is press the download button, download it, and you can then go and install it. After you've installed it, right click on Optifine, hover over open with, press choose another app and select Java and press always. Then it will go and run, and then what we can do is go and press install like so. You may think nothing's happening, but don't worry, it is. And if you're still struggling to go and get it working, you may need to do something called a jar fix, which links jar and jar files together again. When it's finished installing, you'll get a success pop-up and we can close it. Now, let's open Minecraft. Go to the left of the play button, and there you can go and select Optifine 1.21.6, and then you can go and press play, confirm you're playing a modified version. In the bottom left, it will say modded. We can press options and video settings. You'll notice there are different options here and I'll say Optifine in the bottom left. And you can use shaders and access more settings as well. That's it. You should also notice a better experience when playing the game as well. Here we are, we're now in the game. And what we can do is go and pause it. And if we press options and video settings, you'll notice you've got way more different settings you can go and adjust. But also you should notice that your playing experience is just better as well. So hopefully you found this useful. If you did, please consider subscribing and liking the video. Remember, if you're in need of a Minecraft server, then you can go and check out Apex Hosting. A big thanks to them for sponsoring this video. And there'll be a link down below if you're interested in them. And if you need any more Minecraft videos, make sure you go and check out the channel. There are a ton there amongst many other guides which should hopefully solve your problem. Have a great day. Goodbye.